Allison and I'm studying clinical sciences in the University of Bristol. Clinical sciences actually offers us a chance to understand how the bench work um, discoveries can be translated to bedside practices. I think enrichment year is a wonderful experience for all of us. I think it really granted a chance to, um, to look at outside the medical world and it is really eye-opening. My research project is done in the musculoskeletal research unit in Bristol, which is about progression of osteoarthritis. And I have the opportunity to do a research project on my own, and that would be very useful when, like, after a couple of years, when I become a doctor, because there are lots of knowledge coming in every day, and as a doctor, we have to keep ourselves abreast of new information so as to provide the best care for our patients. Bristol is fun. There is, uh many rock climbing sites or many cycling trails around the city and the vibe is great. I like this city very much. Yeah, and one of the major challenges that I think all of us will have to overcome was that we have to take care of ourselves. So we have to cook for ourselves, we have to do the laundry and everything else that was perhaps we don't have the chance to do it in Hong Kong. In my enrichment year, I had the opportunity to come here to do human sciences, which uses an interdisciplinary approach to look into diseases or people through a biological, social and a cultural perspective. And that really gave me um, a broadening um, pr perspective in terms of seeing and uh, seeing what diseases are and in healthcare in general. Well, it's very good that Haley, as a medical student, um, has come here. Um, and has, if you like, sported um, courses relating to population and human sciences. Because a human sciences degree at Oxford is something which, in which students combine um, studying genetics or ecology or evolutionary um, anthropology or social anthropology with population. Um, and our objective in this is precisely to deal with, let's say, the human side of medicine. For my extracurriculars, I've been playing a lot of squash for the University at Oxford. Um, and that gave me a really good opportunity to tour around different cities in the UK, as well as squash, I've been doing a lot of service. So with a background in working with NGOs in Hong Kong, I've wanted to learn more about how charities and NGOs operate in the UK. Hi, I'm Victor Yik. In my enrichment year, I study in the past in the London School of Medicine and Dentistry, and I study global health. In the clinical attachment in pediatric neurology, I have seen patients with rare genetic diseases like Angelman syndrome, as well as epilepsy patients. Although the prognosis in some cases can be very disheartening, seeing a smile from a child witnessing the love between parents and kids are truly heartwarming. Unlike my fellow classmates in Bristol and Glasgow, me and Edmund are the only two integrating students here in Queen Mary. As the Chinese old saying goes, I see this as an opportunity to make friends with other British and also international students. Students. I've met people from all parts of the world and I think it's very beneficial for me to become a global citizen. And Richmond Year has helped me find my passion in medical studies and I'm more ready to face the upcoming challenges in my future studies. If I'm to describe a Richmond Year in one word, I would say it's fulfilling. I've really done something that I've never done before. I didn't imagine I would carry out a research project on my own. If I were to describe enrichment year in one word, I would say it is refreshing. Being able to study in the UK really refreshed my mind and I had a lot of great experience here.